The annual edition of Unzip Your Knowledge is shown every year at the Rhodes University Drama Department. And when I do face my claims, you say I've plagiarized. The show, based on the Rhodes University Learning Guide, written by Dr. Chrissy Bowie, focuses on plagiarism and the various social issues faced by university students. They're depending on me to graduate and to get a job. The recent university budget cuts has resulted in the use of more student performers. The use of more student performers makes the play more provocative and relatable, as the director explains. For the last two years we've had professional reform actors that have come in. Um, this year we decided to use students. The reason for using students this year is I think we had a bit of a smaller budget, but we also wanted to get different perspectives. What different stories would we get from people that are in it right now? I speak three languages. Three. My English is better than the course. I think um, it should be performed by his students. Yeah, Abantu Abazao. Okay, not we're going on the same route that you guys are going. We not Abandabazoti, we used to go on the same route. Abandabazoti, we are currently on the same steps that you're taking, guys. Yeah, well, I think it works better that way. Yeah, not everyone of us take English as the first language. The show is in its third year running, and this year has brought some changes to it. This year, I wanted to not be safe, um, to get the ideas from the cast, get their perspectives throw them on the stage in the understanding that not everyone's going to have the same perspective. But when I go to Stellenbosch, I adapted and I managed. The whole university can't change its system because you're struggling. It generates a lot more conversation. Um, and I think that if we had, there, there's a political climate in the university at the moment that you need to reflect. Um, the students, the first years, are very politically conscious and very politically aware and socially aware. So if we had played it safe, it would have been a cop-out. <laughs> I, I usually think like a guy and I come here and I get to realize actually people do struggle here, you know, it's very difficult. If you don't talk about it, then you talk about people who say the same opinions as us, who don't challenge how we feel. I'm a like, strong believer in music and dance and just how music and dance can convey a message to everyone, even if it's not your language. This is Michelle Wilson Kala reporting for M Squared T Squared News. <laughs>